Hey there, my name is Jabril, and in this video I'm going to talk about how to actually mount the small rig Ninja 5 cage for the Animus Ninja 5. The cage does not only protect the device, but also gives the Ninja 5 different mounting points like quarter 20, 3 8 and nail rail. When you order a small rig slash Atom X cage from small rig, you get the cage itself, two quarter 20 screws, three allen keys and then you get four m3 screws but you actually don't need all of the screws for mounting the cage you only need one quarter 20 screw the big allen key and the medium sized allen key and two of the small m3 screws and that's it you don't need anything else on the side of the cage you see the driver locks for the atmos master caddy 2 it basically just helps to hold the master caddy in place because the normal size caddy sticks a little bit out but for mounting the cage you need to take the driver locks off first because there is screw holes next to it that you need to get access to so start by using the medium sized allen key and taking them off. And as you can see there is two small countersunk screw holes. And next to it is where the screw holes for the driver locks is. And if you turn the cage on the side you can see the two and three screw holes. Normally you would think that you will need to mount the cage with the screw from the bottom. But actually this cage is meant to be mounted from the top. As you can see there there is a countersunk screw hole here as well. So start by placing the device inside the cage, turn it on the top and align the screw holes and use one of the quarter 20 screws. The big allen key should fit here. Tighten it but not all the way, give it some room to wiggle. You first need to place all of the screws before tighten it all the way. Turn it on the side and align the small M3 screw holes and start tightening them but again not all the way. When you place both of them then start tightening the screw a little bit more but be gentle. Turn it on the top again and tighten the 120 screw all the way. And then on the side again and tighten that all the way. And that's actually it. Now if you want you can screw the driver locks onto the two screw holes. But I'm not going to do that because I have the mini SSD from Angelbird that fits the device without sticking out from the side. A great lightweight cage from Smallway that was made together with Atmos. My name is Daryl, thanks for watching.